Hey, what's up? Welcome in my new YouTube studio. Okay, I'm just kidding. This is the next video from Palermo, Italy. And I'm just in my fancy hotel room with this cool lighting on the background. So I hope that this setup will be okay to present you this new gear which I just bought a few weeks ago. And this will be exclusively this small pouch which consists of course in a new wireless mic which is Synco G2 A1. The name of this wireless mic means G2 because it's the second version of this mic and A1 because it has only one transmitter and one receiver. So it is applicable of course only to one person talking to the mic. Starting from this pouch because I'm right now in travel and I took this mic with me and I have to say that it is super handy to have all the accessories to this mic inside this pouch which actually came with the mic. So you are purchasing mic and this pouch with all the accessories inside. And when traveling you should not be worried about any damage because it is safe inside this quite decent pouch. Let me show you what is inside. There is a mic itself, so the transmitter and receiver and this small compartment on the top where you can put all your accessories like charging cable which is also very smart because you have two devices to charge transmitter and receiver and actually you have USB cable with two endings so you can charge both devices in one time very smart solution the cable to plug the mic to camera a laugh mic with a small dead cut on the top there is also a small dead cut because you can you can attach the transmitter directly to your shirt and then in case of the weather conditions you can attach that small dead cut on the top of the transmitter this is a transmitter itself and by simply attaching the dead cut to the mic you have a windproof on the top of the mic and you can you know attach it to your shirt like this okay i'm not very much tech and spec guy so if you want all the specs of this mic i will put them right now on the screen okay so these are two devices the receiver and transmitter i won't be describing all the buttons because you can easily find the pretty detailed reviews on youtube so i will just test them with my vlogging setup which is right now fujifilm xs10 and the small gimbal which i purchased a few weeks ago and you can so the unboxing in the previous videos this is Zhiyun M2S and right now I'm using it as a tripod because right now I did not bring with me any tripod so it is just right now my tripod to record myself in the hotel room and as I mentioned in the previous videos I bought this wireless mic to make my vlogging setup because my boom mic which is mounted on the top of the camera was too high and I cannot operate the gimbal properly when using a mirrorless camera with the boom mic so I was hoping that if I will mount this small receiver on the top of the camera there will be enough space to move the gimbal during the shooting but unfortunately I tested it and even this small receiver is too big mounted on the top of the camera and I cannot fully operate the gimbal so I can use it only as a vlogging kit but if I want to move some fancy 
gimbal moves, tilting or some low movements next to the ground, it won't be able to record with the receiver on the top of the camera. So I have to just figure it out how to mount differently this uh, receiver on the top of the camera because I have some idea but you know right now I'm on vacation so I do not have any tools to remount it in some other way. Okay, so I showed you the mic. I think it will be very good for like vlogging purposes and to record myself. Actually, right now I can switch the mic because I'm right now using the boom mic. I can switch it and you will see and you will hear actually the difference between this wireless mic and the boom mic which I'm using right now. So right now I'm switched to the Synco G2A1 and I have a transmitter attached to my t-shirt and the receiver attached to the hot shoe on my mirrorless camera. So this is the sound not modified directly from the mic right now. So you can hear the difference between the boom mic which I was using previously and the Synco wireless mic and if you would like to also hear how it is performing with the lav mic I can right now switch to the small lav. Okay the lavalier mic is attached to my t-shirt and right now you are hearing me speaking to the lav mic with small dead cut. This is the sound from the Synco G2 A1 with the lav mic attached to my t-shirt. Okay so that's it for the inside review. Uh, let's go outside and I will show you how this setup is performing on the go in the city during a vlog recording. Hey, what's up? It's Bart again from Palermo. The weather is still beautiful. It's very hot, like 35 degrees probably. And as usual, I decided to hike the Mount Pellegrio, in, if I'm not mistaken, in pronunciation. And right now, I just arrived on my new ride electric bike which I borrowed here in Palermo. This will be very hard hike even if the mound is not too high but the temperature, the weather here in Palermo is just crazy. I decided that I start filming today with the small vlogging kit DJI Osmo Action together with my new wireless mic so we can use this possibility as a test outdoor test of this mic I have the transmitter attached to my backpack you can see it right there and the receiver is attached to the camera and this is the audio directly from the Synco G2A1 I would like to test the performance of this wireless mic because right now it is quite windy I put the small dead cut on the mic transmitter so it should 
handle that wind noise and I would like to also check whether this working time just look what a view this is the first view on the harbor marina with the big touristic ships and all the Palermo surrounded by the hills okay let's go let's go higher so I would like to check whether the working time of this mic will be equal with the information provided by the Cinco. We will see. I started this hike about 1 p.m. It should take me around, I don't know, maybe three, maybe four hours up and down. So I will check whether it will be working when I will be ending this hike. are just outstanding. Okay, just a few minutes of break. I have to drink something and just rest a little bit. I just hope that this mic is performing pretty good right now and I won't be disappointed and there up on the hill there is some kind of castle I'm not sure that I will be able to go there and just visit this place but we will see maybe when I will be going down I will have more power to just go there and visit this beautiful castle okay let's go no time for resting right now after this hike i would love to go back to hotel and just swim a little bit have a look and the hotel is somewhere there Just look what is happening here. Oh, what a beautiful view. Right now, the trees behind me covered the beautiful view on the seaside and the gulf with marina and harbor. But please wait. I have like half an hour and I will be on the top of that mountain and i will show you the beautiful view all around the palermo and the sea and okay i'm finally on the top of that mountain Okay, I've reached the top of the mountain. Unfortunately, I cannot see the whole Palermo panorama from this uh, viewpoint, but I can see the sea actually behind me and the part of Palermo and the harbor on this side. 
but the views are just amazing. The blue of the sea touching the blue of the sky, it's just amazing. I can spend here like few hours, but you know, I have to go back, so I do not have a lot of time. So I have to just drink some water and go back. But the views are just outstanding. Just have a look. And right there, there is a Mondello beach where we will be spending our time tomorrow and resting <laughs> after my today's hike. 